Hello everyone, I'm back with another video. In this video, we are going to discuss how we can download and install Eclipse IDE 2018-12. So that's been said, let's get started. For that, open your favorite browser and search for Eclipse and open the link from eclipse.org. Don't worry about the link, link will be on the description box. So this is the official website of Eclipse IDE and here you can see the latest version of Eclipse is Eclipse IDE 2018-12. So to download the latest version of Eclipse IDE, just click on this download button and after that you will be redirected to the download page. So here we have Eclipse IDE 2018-12 and this is for 64-bit version. So let us download this Eclipse IDE. Here we get the download option and here you can see we are downloading from Japan and the file name is Eclipse install win64bit.exe file. So let me click on this download button to download my Eclipse IDE 2018-12. So here you can see it is downloading and it is around 50 MB. So let me complete the download. And here you get some donation option. So if you want to donate to Eclipse community, then you can donate to them. Because Eclipse community also needs some money to improve their product. It's not mandatory, but if you want to donate to Eclipse community, then you can donate. By the way, Eclipse IDE 2018 is free to use. So the download has been completed. Let us open the file to install. So here we have the installation window. So let me minimize the browser. And here we have our Eclipse installer. We can use Eclipse for Java developers, Java EE developers, C and C++ developers and for other programming language too such as PHP, JS, so we are going to set up Eclipse IDE for Java developers because Eclipse IDE is famous for Java. For that first of all we have to update this installer file. So here on the hamburger menu here we have a alert symbol. Just click on this and here you find a alert symbol on updates. So let me click on this update and here we have to accept our license agreement and here it's checking for update. So we had successfully updated our Eclipse installer. So let us click on OK and it's automatically open our Eclipse installer file. Now here we get the Eclipse installer. Let us click on Eclipse IDE for Java developer. Let me tell you that before installing Eclipse IDE for Java developer, you have to install Java on your computer. So if you haven't installed Java on your Windows computer, I had already made a video on how to install Java on your Windows computer in 2019. You will get the video link on the description box or you will get on the i button. First of all, install Java on your computer, then follow this tutorial. Here you can see it will automatically detect your Java version and your installation path. And this is the installation folder where Eclipse is going to install. After that, you can check this box to create desktop shortcut or you can create start menu entry. So let me check this box and let me click on install. Again we get another license agreement. So if you want to read this license agreement, then you can read this license agreement. So for now I'm just going to click on accept now. And now here you can see it is installing Eclipse IDE 2018-12. And here we get Eclipse Foundation Software User Agreement. Just click on this accept button to accept this user agreement. Installation process may take some time so be patient. And here we have to accept the certificate. To accept a certificate just click on select all and click on accept selected. Here you can see installation has been successfully completed. Let us launch our Eclipse IDE. For that click on launch button. So here you can see here we have our Eclipse IDE 2018-12. While we open our Eclipse IDE, we have to select our workspace. So this is the default workspace of Eclipse IDE. If you want to change your default workspace, then you can change by clicking on this browse button. So for now, I'm just going to keep it default and click on launch. And here we get the welcome screen. Welcome to the Eclipse IDE for Java developers. Let me maximize the window. And here you can get some information regarding Eclipse ID. For now, let me close this welcome screen. And let me show you how you can create your first Java project using Eclipse ID. For that, click on file. 
then click on new and choose java project and here you have to name your java project let me name it as my project after naming your project just click on next and here we have our project hierarchy inside our project folder we get a source folder inside this source folder all the source code will be saved so let me click on finish and here we have to create module info.java so let me name it as my project and click on create so this is our module info.java folder so now let us create our java class to create your java class just right click on this source folder and click on new and after that go to class and here you have to name your class let me name it as my class you have to name your class in camel case order and after that you have to select public static void main function then click on finish so here we have my class dot java file let me print hello world to print your hello world just write system dot out dot print and between this parenthesis we have to write our hello world string to run this program just click on this run button and select your class file and click on ok here on the console here you will get hello world so this way you can download and install eclipse ide on your windows 10 computer so that's it for this video if you like this video don't forget to hit that like button and subscribe to the channel for more videos like this